Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, a week or two ago, I posted a video that Microsoft officially had confirmed the Windows 11 annual feature update for this year, version 24H2, that will be released later in the year, and that we will not be getting Windows 12 this year. And although not confirmed by Microsoft, I'm sure we should start seeing Windows 12 in 2025 or 2026. Now, that was according to the latest blog post for a, a the Dev and the Canary channels, Bolt 26052, which rolled out around about the 9th, 8th, 9th of February. And I'll leave that video down below if you'd like some more info. Now, just to let you know that um, once again, Microsoft has confirmed this year's annual feature update because they have updated their Flight Hub. And this was spotted by Zeno over on X uh, once again. And the Flight Hub, if we just head over to that, and as we can see, is Microsoft's official page for tracking Windows inside of preview builds for each major Windows release. And uh, yeah, we can see that in this article listed here right at the top, they are now calling it Windows 11, the 2024 update, also referred to as 24H2. And just like the previous two major releases, 22H2 and 23H2, uh, for Windows 11, this will also receive the same branding. So for Windows 22H2, it was called the 2022 update, 2023 update for 23H2. And this year, like the previous two version upgrades, the Windows 11 2024 update 24H2. And the big difference between a moment update and a version update or an annual feature update is that the moment update only updates the build. Whereas you can see the, the single annual feature update updates the actual version from 22H2 to 23H2 to 24H2. So that's basically the difference. And of course, we get features rolling out as well. Now, the Windows 11 2024 update, uh, as I've posted previously, is expected to roll out, I would say, starting uh, in September, moving into October and November of this year, 2024. And as Microsoft said that um, the OS Windows 11 um, would only get one major feature update every year, as opposed to two, like it was previously over on Windows 10, and I've posted on that quite in depth. And we are also expecting 23H2 of Windows 11, which is the current stable release, uh, to get its uh, fifth wave of new features, Moment 5, which we could expect to see start rolling out as early as next week, the 27th, which will be Tuesday. And that will also be the last Moment update for Windows 11 23H2, because when 24H2 rolls out, obviously then Microsoft will start the Moment updates with 24H2, which are smaller updates that they roll out uh, one to three times a year as opposed to the annual feature update, as you can see, which has rolled out progressively once a year over the last couple of years. So I just wanted to put it out there um, because obviously this now officially once again confirms that the Windows 11 2024 update version 24H2 is coming later this year. And if you want more info regarding version 24H2 of Windows 11, I'll leave a playlist that'll be here somewhere on the screen in the end screen of this video if you would be interested. And regarding Windows 12, as mentioned, um, I don't think we're going to see Windows 12 this year. Uh, that is not, there's nothing in Microsoft documentation that even refers to a Windows 12 for this year. But as mentioned, I'm sure Windows 12 will make its way to, into um, the kind of into it being in 2025, moving into 2026. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.